Good evening. I know I'm not supposed to say what time it is, but it's actually kind of late here. And we are going to be talking about Melaleuca today. And after I read my intro, then I will say hi to the live chat. I'll play my disclaimer so we don't get slapped and we'll, we'll start right away. Uh, Melaleuca is a health and wellness company that offers a wide range of products, including mm, maybe more expensive than normal personal care, home cleaning, and dietary supplements. The company was founded in 1985 and is headquartered in Idaho Falls, Idaho, United States. Melaleuca distributes its products through a direct selling model, also known as a multi-level marketing company, with customers shopping online or through independent representatives. The company places a strong emphasis on natural and eco-friendly ingredients, and many of its products are free of harsh chemicals and synthetic additives. Melaleuca has gained a reputation for its commitment to sustainability with initiatives such as sourcing ingredients from sustainable farms, using recyclable materials in product packaging, and reducing waste in manufacturing processes. And we are going to find out if that is actually the case today on this video. The company has also been recognized for its charitable work, including donations to disaster relief efforts and support for education and healthcare programs. And I'm saying this in a little bit of a snarky voice because when you so highly price your products out of what pe people would normally pay, I guess you can do whatever you want with the profit that you're getting. I'm going to go ahead and play the please don't slap us YouTuber, YouTuber, YouTube um, intro and, oh, I was so close to having a good intro. <laughs> oh, where is it? Where is it? Oh, my God. All right. D technical difficulties coming in hot. My stomach just dropped because I thought I was muted in the first uh, 45 seconds that I was live. Oh my god. Um, why are we doing this? A few, maybe last week, I was like, Jesse Lee Ward is too much. This is stressful. I want to cover something not that. And a bunch of y'all in the live chat um, told me about different ones to cover. I think that um, someone just told me, yes... Buttercup just said that Deanna just did Melaleuca. Incredible. There's a lot better people than me making videos. Deanna, Isabella, Hannah, Chelsea. I mostly just want to hang out with my live stream buddies and snoop together. <laughs> Which probably makes sense why some of my videos don't perform well. But uh, here we are. Um, I am going through that list that y'all put into my community tab. And... Uh, Melaleuca was on there, so we're gonna we're gonna take a snoop a snoop session. You forgot to make your tater tots off. Oh no! <laughs> oh my god! We're gonna have a tater a potato cast super um, in in the future, maybe in the next couple weeks. Alexis, I hope your doctor's appointment goes well tomorrow. I know that those can be super stressful. And um, I'm glad we get to snoop around Melaleuca together and maybe get your mind off your doctor's appointment. Jen, Mia, Ladies on Lions, Lindsay, Danielle. Oh, you got to take Bubba outside. I hope I hope that goes well. Um, and yes, uh, I think Buttercup said Deanna had a horror stories. It's too coincidental. Yeah, this was mostly just from my list i was gonna do the body shop but i saw that isabella just did a body shop video today or yesterday and i was like oh forget it <laughs> so we're just doing melaleuca and i guess i messed up because deanna did it already <laughs> oh well oh well you made yourself disappear for a second that was cool uh I, yeah 
One of her horror stories talked about them claiming not to be an MLM. Yes, they are. They are notorious for saying we're not a multi-level marketing company. We're we're whatever we are. We just sell from from our individual reps to the people. It's not MLM. It is. It is MLM. My goal is to be a stream buddy ASAP. <laughs> we're um. We are going to be getting back to our gaming streams. I just have been, you know, low energy. I I think I slept for too long today. I'm just not feeling the best. All right. Okay, buckle up. We're going to figure this out. And I am going to do a little bit. It's not going to be a super clean um reaction we're not going to do the computer with me we are going to do the right scene reaction okay great god dang it okay let me edit this i need it to be safari and there's my intro love it love to see it where is it there it is all right why am i reading intros because I need help with everything. Okay, expand. I don't want to see my tabs. Nope. I do not want to see that. Okay, sorry guys. I have this full screen. I, that's pretty good. That's pretty that's pretty close to what I see on my my screen. This is Melaleuca, the wellness company. Oh my gosh. Why do I Oh, is that me? Is that my line? Yep, that is me. Just off to an incredible We're off to an incredible start. Technical difficulties and just a flippity flopping Flip show, because we're not cussing yet, because we've got five minutes left. I moved some of my desk stuff around. Okay, so this is clean homes, clean, clean streams, clean conscience. Come on. Making safer, more effective, eco-friendly, and affordable products you will love. How much do these cost? All right. Look, they're in Idaho Falls. The guy who started it is the guy on the cover of this video. And we should have captions. So if you need to turn those on, they're not going to be perfect. They're just auto-generated. But if you need captions, they are there. Danielle! Y'all, if you haven't subbed to Danielle, what are you doing with your life? <laughs> the high voice always sends me. <laughs> Oh my god. Not to be confused with the mental wellness company. You know what? I know we were going to do we should do a bracket system worst MLMs, we should do bracket system worst um independent contractors. We should do a bracket system of like coaches and then our bracket system of our food snacking. Two years ago, Kiki Chanel covered Beach Body Power Hour. That was insane. There was an obnoxious um, AF shaved head chick, and I'm dying for an update. Oh my gosh, I know who that is. I don't know if she's still in Beach Body. Leave it. Um, there's a community post and like, what MLMs do you want to cover? Leave it in there, and I'm basically going through and doing those recommendations. Oh my god, yes. We need to create the coach family tree. We do. Plus one to Elaine and captions. <gasps> Elena! I I am happy that it works. Sometimes it doesn't. Uh, sometimes it doesn't save when I try to set it up. So I double check this time and I think it's good to go. Uh, let's just see. What else? Can I just say this? Why wouldn't you... Like, clean homes. Why wouldn't the bold part be on the clean if that's your point? Like, if that's the point that you're trying to make, that we make clean products, clean streams, clean conscience? 
also, like, is the whole statement trademarked? And why is it so far away from, from the statement? Normally, the TM is so much closer. Okay. Holding nature to a higher standard. Ugh! Melaleuca amplifies the power of nature, delivering a holistic approach to wellness. Oh my god. What is happening? Yeah, she isn't a beach body anymore. She has the black ink. Yep. If they cared about marketing, they wouldn't be in an MLM, you know? The world wonders. Wellness. See, you see, now they're putting they're putting the bold on the wellness. And they and they are looking at clean too. So why why wouldn't why would they do that? Um, I know, I'm just I'm losing my mind. That's why I don't really like looking at stuff because I just I can't see the 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 whole picture because I just pick it apart. It's not bad, it's not awful. Home cleaning and laundry. Saul Umel, three in one cleaner. This is like thieves. Twelve times all purpose. Okay, not that expensive. Interesting. It's not as expensive as I thought it was going to be. Look at all these cleaners, though. You have to buy a million. Wait, why are they selling Diamond Bright? It looks like another... It look, This looks like another branding from another company. This is not as expensive as I thought. Diamond Bright Gel Automatic Dishwasher Detergent 2-Pack. This feels like Amway. Like, buy everything you need for your house. And make money when other people buy everything you need for your house. Show all. This is boring as hell. We're gonna go to YouTube next, don't worry. I mean, it, it's not as expensive as I thought it was gonna be. I will tell you that right now. Howdy, Shelby. How are you? <gasps> My BFF family member has not sold Melaleuca for years. <laughs> yeah, this is totally an MLM. I think they think it's kind of like a co-op that, hey, you're buying stuff for your house, and if your other friends sign up under you to buy stuff for their house, how can it be an MLM? Literally, by definition, it's a multi-level marketing company because, say it with me, there's multiple levels. I'm going to try to make sure my mic doesn't cover my mouth, but I'm just kind of slurching in my chair. It looks like finished jet dry, kind of. Yep. Oh, my gosh. Look at this whole savings pack. $114.99. A spray bottle. Well, how are they making their money then? Do they just make this for so cheap and they sell it for such a high price? <gasps> Medicines and treatments? Um, by definition? By definition, you cannot list it as a medicine because it's a fucking supplement. Holy shit, Crystal. You got your mom to cancel her doTERRA auto ship? Wait, where's my applause? Yes. Yes. Yes, Norwex is another thing. They think that their silver uh, wipeable stuff kills everything. Just the just the cloth. Yeah, medicines. Where are we? How do we get to this part of the internet? Amanda, what's up? Yeah, the the fun thing about the live is sometimes y'all get to control the adventure because we're just we're just meandering about. We're about to look at the YouTube in a second. Renew. Where's the medicine? Natural insect repellent. How how is it so cheap? 
I bet this is how they get people to sign up for Melaleuca because they're... Oh my god, they sell ibuprofen? How do they do that? They sell allergy tablets? This is so like Amway. Counteract 1B? Y'all, make sure your buddies and your family is not buying this stuff. Oh my god. Penetrate? Are you serious? Don't with that name. Penetrate? Like penetrate? Penetrate original targets the, mus the muscle aches and pains associated with every wait i need my i need my um i have a voice mod hold on i have something fun for y'all maybe it's not going to be fun voice mod um Can y'all? Oh God, this is not me. Oh. oh my God, I don't know. Do I sound different right now? If I don't, I need to fix it. Do I sound like a man or a a, a, a deep voiced person? Because if I don't, I have to fix it. Wait, do we sound like a man now? I mean, a deep voice person? How's that? Oh my god. This is messed up. God, I hate it. What is happening? Man. I'm oh, no, 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 Combining four naturally powerful ingredients, Penetrate, original targets the muscle aches and pains associated with everyday activity, used as a carrier for its penetrating properties. Uh, T36C5 registered. Melaleuca oil delivers the targeted benefits of camphor, menthol, and methyl salicylate. Salicylate? deep into the muscles to bring quick relief through its unique hot, cold sensation. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, everyone. Look, I, I, it worked the other day. It, it, it worked the other day. It worked the other day. And of course, it's not going to work on stream. My little... My little overlay doesn't work. Nothing works. Subscribe to my channel. You too can experience technical difficulties every single stream. I'm just kidding. I'm just joking. All right. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Demon guy here, Jesse Lee Ward. <laughs> Are we gonna have to read everything that Jesse Lee says with this voice going forward? Oh my god. Oh my god. It's a very sweet sounding demon. I love that. I know, it's like, what are we doing? Well, we're just we're just roaming the internet together, wandering aimlessly, trying to figure out what the hell's going on at Mount Luca. All right, how do I join? Holy shit, essential oils. <gasps> Wait, why is this not loading? 
Why does, why do you have a broken, is that a broken link? Why essential oils pure? Mm, pure. Look how cheap this is compared to doTERRA and Young Living. Oh my God. Pure take root grounding roll on 1375. It's basically free. You know how expensive essential oils are at Young Living? Hella expensive. I know. I'm like, I'm not trying to make this company look good. I'm saying, how are they selling all this stuff for so cheap? Shelby, I hope that you um, feel better soon. Yes. Yes, we can. Let's go to... Let's go to medicine. And... Let's make sure that this is in secondary display. And then we will do... Um, wait, how come I... Hold on. And then, gosh dang it. No. You know what? You can just stop this nonsense immediately. Now I have three pages. Holy shit. Just go over here. And I want you to go over here. Okay. So we've got. Let's look at the medicine. Uh, but we need to see how many is in here. Counteract pain. 500 milligram acetaminophen for fast 50 tablets. Okay. So what would be acetaminophen? Extra. Okay, let's look at, which would be Tylenol, right? Pain reliever. Not Amazon, probably like Walmart. Am I about to debunk myself? Because I'm not going to be excited if that happens. 500 milligram acetaminophen, it's the same thing. Oh, uh, I don't know why this is so... I know, I'm just ruining this stream. I'm not trying to be negative, I just, I'm just, I don't like messing up and it makes me upset. <laughs> uh, all right, extra strength, this is 100 capsules. So this is still cheaper. Melaleuca is still cheaper, holy moly. Because if we double the cost for, so, if you're if you're a rep, four forty nine times two is about nine but nine dollars and change. Maybe it's not. I'm so bad at math. It's like nine dollars and change. And then this is eleven ninety nine. This is two dollars more and you're not gonna have your soul sucked into a multi level marketing company. Uh this is a hundred capsules on the left, and then this is fifty capsules on the right. For an off-brand. Compare store brand. Okay. Look up generic. Okay. Generic. Okay. Let me look. Generic extra strength acetaminophen. Oh. Similar price? Um, why are you so zoomed in? Okay. This is 24 caplets of CBS brand. 549. So Mel Luke is still cheaper. Why 
wild. Extra strength, pain relief, acetaminophen. Two, okay, we finally found one that's cheaper. 225 for 13 bucks, so this is cheaper. And I'm guessing you're... Katya, hello! We need the cost of the memberships. Okay, we'll do that next. And, and CVS, you're going to pay a premium, in my opinion, anyway, because it's like a... You know... Uh, holy shit, I ran out of something. I gotta go get it. And I'm on the corner store. Walmart one was 15 for 225 Yep, and this one's $13.99 for 225 So it's this is cheaper. I think I just didn't look at enough. So you are you are still paying for more with the Melaleuca. In my opinion. Can you imagine me getting a cease and desist letter from Melaleuca? Hopefully, I never do. Let's go Rite Aid. <laughs> How are they making money? The can, the monthly orders you got to do, I'm guessing. Okay, let me go over here. That was my cover image. So let's go to... All right. We are going to go to... Oh, no. No. Menu. I want to sign up. Sales and materials, new member savings. And we're going to watch a YouTube video after this, so. It's going to get fun. You have to sign up with one of these packs. There was a girl that got terminated who was on Jesse Lee Ward's team. Who got terminated from the company right after Empire U a few years ago. And then she went to Melaleuca and then she went to another company and now she's at Awakened. Limited time for first two months. Home conversion pack. Two ninety nine special pack price. Four seventy one thirty one is the member price. A hundred and fifty hundred and fifty points. You may only purchase this product during your first two months as a new member. What? Really? Are you serious right now? Did we just do that? We did just do that. I cannot believe you. All right. I know. I'm the one that did that. Let's look and see if we can find a Melaleuca opportunity call. There's a monthly minimum order. Yep, that's probably how they're making money too. I'm going to set this behind me. There we go. Target brand 100 count costs $1.99. I should have done that. Why are these all... Okay. Why are they always in front of me? Okay, let me just do that. All right. Um... They are really hiding the fact that they are not a multi-level marketing company. Oh my God, that kid's cute. Inspired by nature, proven by science. Better ingredients, better pizza, Papa John's. That's what this sounds like. Your monthly shopping club. That's why they are... This is why they are fighting the idea that they are a multi-level marketing company. When they are actually a multi-level marketing company. <gasps> Holy crap. Y'all are better at this than me. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing here. Thank y'all. I was like, oh my God, I'm finding all the expensive shit. <gasps> Alice X, hello. Finished a benchmark at school today, and I have keysto um, keystones next month. Congratulations. I don't know what's going on with my... <laughs> yes. <laughs> they fight so hard that they are not a multi-level marketing company, and they will say in their cold messages when people say, Hey, isn't this... 
hey, isn't this a multi-level marketing company? And they'll be like, no, it's not. It's not an MLM. It's direct sales. Or it's a, your monthly shopping club. All right. But they aren't. They're a monthly shopping club, okay? You know what, Danielle? I'm going to put this over here so I don't keep putting it on top of my face. <laughs> Alice, I thought you said ketones. <laughs> Shadow, what's up? Okay, let's go. Let's go to YouTube. Jessica Hickson. Truth about Melaleuca. Melaleuca Review. I don't know who that dude is. All right, let's just go over here. I was introduced to Mel Luca about two years ago. I um, enrolled with Mel Luca as a customer because I wanted Good. the products. We were looking for better, safer products for our home. And I was frustrated with trying to find quality products that actually worked. So I don't have to go to Target anymore. I don't have to bring the kids in the store with me anymore. She's like, no. And in my head, I was like, okay, my Target budget can just be switched right over to Melaleuca. This is the same dollars. I was thrilled. This is what I genuinely use and need. This is my Amazon.com one-stop shopping. It's so much easier. We ordered the home conversion pack, and in that pack was the peak performance vitamins. Within three weeks, I was really starting to feel different. I was most excited about the omega-3 supplement because that was a goal that we had had, I had personally for our family that I just couldn't figure out how to make it work because we couldn't eat salmon four or five times a week. Um, and so I was really focused on the omega-3 liquid because my kids loved it and it had exactly what I wanted. And I got the EcoSense pack was my first order and I loved it. It was like Christmas in a box. Um, I loved that it was easier. Spray and wipe. I don't need more hard work, you know, as a mom. I'm shopping it and- What do you mean? What, what, what? I'm, I'm gonna have to rebraid my hair because I look like, I look like I just went through the drying cycle in a drying machine. Um. What do you mean? What do you what, what spray and wipe? Don't you don't doesn't everyone I got got a scrub? Doesn't everyone have to scrub? Also, don't we like going to Target? For $200, you too can get everything you need plus a monthly auto ship to to have a better, healthier home with Melaleuca. Mmm. Lynn, we, you have not missed much because freaking technical difficulties have struck again. Safari's been an asshole, so we had to move over to Chrome, and I thought it was my headphones, so then I put new headphones in, and here we are. And I'm having to re, you know, braid my hair because I look, I just look like an actual, I don't know, a troll under a bridge. This is so early 2000s. Why is it always Target that they shame? I think they want to be like, you know, oh, you can go to Target and you don't have to, you don't have to overspend when you go in there. And don't you want to just be able to get everything you need to your house every month? Well, excuse me, I don't have to buy cleaning supplies every month. You know what I'm saying? You know, I think that they just think they're cheaper than Amway, you know? Ch what? Mm, I don't... I, where should I put... Uh, this layout, we're going to have to work with it. Why do they think they're different than Amway? Amway pushes it the same way. You're just buying all your household items from us. Yep. Thank you, Av. Oh my gosh. I, I don't know if it's a new Amway. I think that they're trying to gain market share by saying you don't have to spend as much money with Amway or Target or anything. Thank you, Elaine. An amazing store. 
At this point, it would take an army to hold me back from sharing it with, with others that I really think would benefit from the value of the Mel Luca brand. I naturally was telling mm. people about it. Y'all, 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 y'all uh, do you, um, overusing the piano sad melody, stop it. It's so cheese city. It's so cheese city. <gasps> hey, Lisa, what up? I was educating people on do you know you can make simple changes in your in your house that can impact the health of your family. When I saw that it was really thinking who can I help and how can I help them, it was very natural. Oh my God. She told me how to invite people, what to say, and what to do to prepare. So really what I did is I just listened to everything that she said. I was really looking for a legitimate way to work from home, um, somehow spend more time with my family, but I still needed the income. Who's At first lady? when I started building my business, I was hopeful that it could be what our family needed. I was hopeful just to replace income that I had made previously. <laughs> my first check with Mel Luca was just over $480 which was incredible to us. I think that's when my husband really gave me the green light to say, okay, I don't really understand what you're doing, but just keep doing this. This is, this is amazing. Danielle, you would win at life. You need to have a cheesy piano track, like on your like built-in soundboard or something on your computer and play it when you're reading something awful from a coach, you know? My first check with Malaluka was $75. And we kind of chuckled a little bit and we were oh, like, okay, we yeah. have worked really hard and we got a $75 check. But the next month, our check was $6,200. You trust? You can't say that. There's no disclaimer on this video. Seeing the process that I would reach the goal, and Susie kept saying, you know. You're doing the right activities, it's going to work. And it did. In farming, we are doing what both of our parents did and both of our grandparents did. But with our Melaleuca business, we're able to do things that they would have never dreamed of doing. Hey, Karina. My mom has really never done anything like that before. She's Karina, I hope you feel better. Taught for 40 years, and she wound up, her first year as senior director, she made over, I think she made like $54,000. She'd never made that any of the 40 years she taught. And that just kind of goes to show sometimes, you know, people, just a normal person, mm -hmm. can really do something with this company. And it doesn't matter where you came from. It doesn't matter what color you are, what religion you are, what nationality you are, or what your occupation is. When they say all roads lead to Maluka, it can, it, that road can start anywhere. It can start from, and, and just looking at my team, I have a stay-at-home mom, I have a school teacher, I have a dental hygienist, a lawyer, a nurse practitioner, a podiatrist. It's not about what you do. It's about who you are. And if you have the spirit to want to enhance somebody's life. Yep, we are going to send to the FTC. We'll do it right now so we can all learn together. From a health standpoint, from a financial standpoint, you can build a Malibu business. Oh my god. This is so chaotic. The All Stars. I wish there was names on this, but we are going to snoop together. New corporate director to Alex Reynoso. Jeff and Maureen Miller. Here's the names. Screenshot. Oh, my Lanta. Okay. Here we go. Here's how we do it. We are going to click on the three dots here. We're going to share it. We are going to copy the link. If you want to take full control of your sales pipeline. We know that's the right link because it said all roads lead to Melaleuca. Then you're going to go to the FTC report. Reportfraud.ftc.gov. You are going to 
Report to help fight fraud. Report now. Money making opportunity. Okay. What type of job investment money making opportunity or franchise was it? Um, I don't know if it's a pyramid scheme. But it's either programmed to be your own boss or to start a business. Probably to start a business, right? I don't think it's a pyramid scheme. Did you pay or send money? No. Were you asked to pay? Well, the starting price for the business, two ninety nine, right? Did you learn first learn about the product online? Um, social media, YouTube. When were you first contacted? What's today's date? You, I know you don't need to fill all this stuff in. Is today the twenty? Oh God, it's the nineteenth. Name of the company. Melaleuca, name the person you dealt with, N.A. Do you have other information about them? This is a link to the video where they are showing large amounts of money made and that everyone can achieve the same success. And I'm going to copy this, and I'm going to put it in the chat for y'all. If you want to use that same thing. Okay, I'm going to turn off the my screen really quickly so that I can fill this out and I don't dox myself. And BR, BRB, one second. Not United Arab Emirates. Um, cell phone. I'm old as hell. I am a dependent. Okay. Okay, here's my report number. So here's what we're gonna do now, everyone. Now we go to Twitter. I'm not, I don't think I'm being an asshole. Is it my name on this? Okay. Oh my God. We are going to uh, do this. I think I'm logged into Twitter over here. Yes. All right. We're on Twitter. At Mela. I'm con. Um, it is troubling to see some of the content that you have posted on your YouTube page that violates the FTC Section Five. Um, uh, FTC Act Section 5 um, regarding income claims here is my FTC report number um, in the image below for your records and I'm going to go here and I know Okay, at FTC. Okay, we see that. Y'all can retweet me if you want. But that way, it's public. All right? All right. But I need to know where you live. Danielle. <laughs> 
Oh, is to is the four twenty um a weed day or something? <gasps> Hello. Thank you. Thanks for being here. We're trying to fix. I need to. I want someone to design a custom chat for me because I don't love this one. It's better than normal, but it's still hard to see. Feeling so old every year. The scroll is longer. Yep. All right, let's look at something different. Melaleuca. Melaleuca opportunity. I want an opportunity call. Would it be on Vimeo? Zoom? The truth about Melaleuca. Melaleuca now sells meat. Ugh. Why did Melaleuca take all their opportunity calls off of YouTube? Okay, let's do award ceremony and then we'll work backwards that way. Soldier honors Melaleuca CEO with the Patriot Award. Oh my God, no way. Melaleuca receives Department of Defense Award. No way. Melaleuca wins Breastfeeding Champion Award. No way. Here we go, Gala. I'm oh, sorry, we've hey. got ads. I was just going for a drive. Which is wild, because up until- We're just gonna wait for the end to pass. Allison, hello! Oh, wait. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I don't know anything. Karina has to explain, like, stuff to me, and so does Jessica, and apparently Danielle does too. So, yes. <laughs> I just found out that the 420 thing a few days ago. Hell yes, Elaine. I love that. Come on, skip, skip. Oh, ah, skip. Oh my god, the music. It's purple, it matches. I'm so stoked. What up, Meluka? City, Utah. It is a beautiful spring evening, capping off three days of discoveries. Marketing executives have made discoveries about new products. They've made discoveries about smart ways to grow their businesses, and they've made goals not only for their businesses, <laughs> but for themselves. And we are so excited to share it all with you, you tonight. Behind me, you can see the stage is getting set here. The tables are being set. And in just a few minutes, thousands of marketing executives will come into this massive hall and have a celebration. We we are, rec we are recognizing Melaleuca's top businesses tonight, and the highlight of tonight begins in about 90 minutes. That's when marketing executives with this year's most successful businesses will be honored. Tonight is a celebration of lives that Melaleuca is enhancing. We're going to meet a lot of cool people tonight during our broadcast. We're going to speak with McKay Christensen and Darren Johnson and several other folks, and we'll have some surprises along the way. You'll want to let your friends know to tune in right now and for the rest of the evening for some unforgettable moments. So let's go right down to the red carpet. That's where Darren Johnson is standing by. Good evening, Darren. All right. Thank you, Nate. And I am here with Executive Director 9, Laura Garza. Hi, Laura. Hi, Laura Garza. Okay, I'm going to open up my sticky notes. I don't know if this is helpful for you all, but this is how I snoop. <laughs> New. Can I just minimize this one? Why is this one so big? I have a million open on my desktop. Oh my god. Earth Day. God. Close. Delete note. Prestige marketing. Delete note. Uh, delete note. Okay. What did she say her name was? Oh, I forgot. 
Thank you, Nate. And I am here with Executive Director 9, Laura Garza. Hi, Laura. Hi, Laura Garza. Hi, Darren. So you, this has been quite a week for you. You learned Stop you double advanced her. to Executive Director 9. How do you... Stop touching her, okay, my dude? you describe the feeling of being here at convention with that type of big news? It's, it was unexpected. I knew about eight, but not nine. I'm so excited, so happy for me. And that meant that I had a lot of people in my team working and having wonderful results. Because of them, I'm here. So I'm excited. But you know what? This has my, been my best, my best convention ever. So in what way? What, what made this convention 2016? I made a shit ton of money. And where it is this year, I will. What made it such a, a great convention for you? I found out what Melaleuca really is. People told me about the history. I knew the history, the past, what we're going through right now, the future. This is old. But today Sorry. I experienced that. Nobody has to tell me anything. I know what it is. Watching Frank, watching you, McKay, everyone working together, caring about each other, about us. I just have that experience. Uh, a hello to DC because say hello to DC wasn't, it's too long. I tried to do the same across my all platforms, but Twitter thwarted me. So it's hello to DC. Thanks to my team, I'm here. Thanks to my huge downline, I ranked up. Say it isn't so. Experience, a live experience of, of this. Yeah, I can tell. I can tell. What, what was the highlight Ugh, of the convention? Greek if you had to pick City. one thing that happened this week and weekend, what would it be? that I need to work on a daily basis. And that's gonna be, uh, bring me a, res a result, a big result. I, this year I will work every single day because I can do better. I Holy shit. You want, where, where's your breaks? Ma'am, why don't we take breaks? Hmm? Breaks? I, I mean, you're gonna tell me you're gonna work 365 days a year? You're saying that's what the opportunity is in Mela freaking Luca? Oh my God. I can always do better, but I, I want to. Okay, so let's talk a bit about your team. Who, tell us a little bit about who's here uh, with you at, at this convention. Who, who, would you, who would you give a shout out to? My senior, she just got to senior director, Gabriela Ladro. She's here with me. Vanke, she's director five, but she's almost there. She's going to work hard this year. All my team from Mexico, it's here from Laredo. We're so excited. We're going to be working together and we're planning wonderful things together here at convention and for the future. Well, we're sure proud of you and Jorge, who's not here with I you. Know, I know, I miss him. Him. I, I, I'm saying hi to Jorge, my kids, my parents, my family, everyone in Laredo, my future seniors directors over, over there. I want everyone to be here next year. They cannot miss this. I'm excited. All right. Well, listen, congratulations to you. Let's take a quick photo on Instagram and then we'll, let, we'll, we'll turn you on your way. Okay. Here we go. All right. Thank you, Laura. Appreciate it very much. And now we have... Okay, we're just gonna. Awesome. Oh my God, this dude's a big guy, in uh, at Melaleuca. There we go. So we're gonna get nice and nice and close here. So let's talk about convention 2016 for you, Corporate Directors Eight. Well, you have one of the largest businesses in all of Melaleuca. You're here with with many on your team. So how would you describe the week that that you've had? You know, it's been great. It's been amazing. Being at convention is one of the best things of the year. We get to celebrate our team's success that thanks to them, we achieved Corporate Director 8, and we're so very proud of all our team. All right, how about you, Rafael? How do you describe the week? Rafael. Well, uh, this is our 12th uh, convention, and by far is the best convention uh, in, in the history Rafael. for us. And we learned so much uh, this weekend, and not only that, just to see the, the light in, the, in people's eyes when they hear you, hear McKay, hear Frank, hear all the trainers. So it's been by far the greatest convention. Wait, what? So Ra Rafael and Monica, Mexico, you brought it up. We recently expanded it into Mexico. T tell us tell us just a little bit about what are you seeing happening all across the globe and in particular in Mexico? What kind of growth are we seeing? Well, obviously we are growing by thousands of customers. And as uh, we've heard, you know, we we're growing. We have the best months ever. Uh, but I see having conventions like this in Mexico in the next few years. And we had a lot of people from Mexico that came here and saw the big vision. So we know that this will happen in Mexico and, and one day maybe Central and South America. We're going to be all over the world. 
That's fantastic. Well, Mel Luca is many things, but it's a company that's founded on these incredible wellness products. And Monica, you were on stage helping launch what some products. Why don't you tell us about your experience on stage just a couple of days ago? What did you do? And we'll talk a little bit about that. Well, I was uh, fortunate enough to be able to present the Say Bella brand. She is leaning the hell away from the sky. And just to loom over, uh, I, I'm, I'm just I'm a little, I'm a little skeeved out, that's all. <laughs> uh, I hope y'all, I mean, this is long form content in its finest. I don't know. What did you do on Wednesday night? Well, we just surfed the internet together and found out what the hell Maluka was up to. Creep City. And uh, it was very exciting to be up there and, you know, talk to women about this excellent beauty line that we have in skincare and the way that they can, can implement it into their business was just, you know, a great experience to be able to speak to them. So, Raphael, you were in the audience Maybe. watching it. What, what did you think? Well, first of all, she looked beautiful on stage and I was uh, very impressed and very proud to see her on stage representing the Hispanic girls and especially the Say Bella line. So I was very proud of her. I'm very, very excited about it. Yeah, you did a fantastic job. Thanks for being Ooh. part of it. So this year I will. This year I will. We were talked all weekend long about what's your goal for this year I will. So your this year I will is? I have a few, but here's the most important one in the business. I will be a corporate director nine. Big goal. Will be. Big go. How about for you? It is same well, I different? Guess, I guess we're both in the same boat. We, we will be corporate director nines. That sounds like a good goal, guys. So listen, let's, uh, uh, before we take an Instagram photo, uh, who's, who's watching at home? Who would you like to give a shout out to back home? And, uh, and then we'll take our shot. Oh, you know what? Of course, my children that I love with all my heart, Andrea, Alexa, and Ashley. I love you guys. I wish you guys were here with me, but everything that we do, we do it for you guys. All right. And yes, I also like to say hello to my mama, mi mama. She's from Mexico, she's at home right now. So, hola mama, como estas? All right, Corporate Directors 8, Rafael and Monica Rojas. Let's take a quick Instagram photo Rojas. and then we'll turn you on your way. Oh my gosh. Right, Rafael, Monica, Rojas. Appreciate you very much. Okay, National Director 3, Beth Shaw. Hi, Beth. Aaron, how are you? I'm doing really well. So. You know, this, this week has been pretty amazing for you, I'm sure, as well. What, what for you has been the highlight of Convention 2016? Making a well, shit the highlight ton of money. every year is seeing the light bulbs go off on my, in my team members. Um, they get to see new people come and, and really set some dreams, and then they see other people that are coming back from last year and seeing their dreams come true. And that, I, that is such a highlight for me. But this year in particular, I think... What impressed me so much is that we have a company that's been around for 30 years and to have the incredible growth that we have, you just don't see that. You see that in companies that are new, but not companies that have been around for 30 years. Yeah. So I love that. It's very inspiring. Well, you've had a great 2016. You are in the running for many, many big awards here this evening. So we have a chance of seeing you on stage. I suspect we might. So what, what award are you, are you running for and what are you most hoping to achieve this evening? Well, there are several different awards that I'm up for, but the one that I'm most interested in is President's Club. That is the crowning jewel, the, the jewel in the crown, if you will. Yeah. So yeah, I'm very excited to see if we mm -hmm. made that. So for those who may not know what President's Club is, how would you describe it? I know it's difficult to describe because it's just one of those it's just one of those experiences, right? It is. Um, how I would describe the contest, the um, honor of winning it is the top 14 businesses in the country. Um, but the trip that accompanies it, it's a trip of a lifetime. You could paint the most first class trip ever and multiply it times two because it's just, you can't, you really can't describe it. It is um, adventure after adventure after adventure and pampered and first class and it's just tremendous what the company does. So Beth, we uh, at Mel Luca, we, we launched, oh, easily Stop 15, 20 new them. products. Yes. Which new product? Can I just say this for the live chat? If you are ever interviewing someone, and I guess this is me, I do not like to be touched. I don't like surprise, like running up against my skin. I wear, normally I will, even in the mid heat of summer, I will wear pants and sweatshirts because I do not want to have to, and this isn't me being like, oh my gosh, I'm so disgusted by humanity. I don't, I don't feel safe, like with my skin exposed. And this dude continues to rub his hand down the back of the women's arms. What are you doing? Ugh, I'm like getting creeped out. 
These hands are rated E for everyone. <laughs> oh my god, Mia. Oh my god. I can't stand when men try to touch me or do the lower back thing. Keep your hands to yourself. Now that I'm older, I don't tolerate it, especially men who want to be close talkers. Hello, the vid. I mean, yeah, I, 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 I'm, I'm like skeeved out right now. What are you the most excited about? Oh, wow. That's a good one. Um, well, the essential oils are always so exciting oh to see because so many people, it's such a growing market, so and they smell so wonderful. So we had them all over the room, our hotel room. So I, I would have to probably say the essential oils. It's fantastic. Well, listen, in 2016, you, you went with your team to Atlantis, and I know you've got a lot of, a lot of your team members are going to be with you this evening, but who's not here that you want to give a shout-out to right now at back, back home? Well, first of all, I'd like to say hi to my husband. I wish you were here. Um, next year, you're going to have to come along and keep all the girls in line. So I want you to ha come with us last next year. Um, so I would like to also say all to the rest of my, my team, the Changing Your Life team, you need to come. You need the to come changing. so that you can see the, the life that you, are des you, are, you deserve to have. And this is how you're going to make it happen, is by coming to convention. Oh It'll God. help you set your dreams, and then you'll be able to see them come Twist true. City. Okay, Beth, listen, uh, we will take Beth? a quick picture, and then we'll, we're will we going to go to uh, Hide Your Bartoladas in the Wings here. So here we go, Beth. Okay, what's her last name? Beth Shaw, thank you. Beth Shaw. Heidi Bartolotta, how are you? Come on in here. I, I've not seen you all all convention. I've, I've seen you from afar. Maybe because she is creeped out by you. Who knows? Far, but hi, by the way. Hi. Nice so, to see you. So you have been very, very busy. You, you come to convention as a national director, nine, double advanced recently. And you have, you're famous because you are the, you're the leader that has the highest number of directors and others in your organization that are with you at, 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 at conventions. So you tell me, why is this such an, a priority for you? Oh, my goodness. Um, convention just absolutely paints the picture of our company and who we are and where we're going. And um, I love convention because it instills this vision in people that I just don't think they can get anywhere else. You have to be in it and really absorb it. And so we heavily, heavily promote convention. So talk about what has been the highlight for you, whether it be a product, a key message, a training, seeing anyone and uh, some come of the, visit your you, own Lynn. people on your team that are here. What, what's been the highlight? I would say two things for me, and I really love the simplification of everything that the company has rolled out for us. I think just making it so much easier for people to have success and giving us those tools that we were really looking for. Um, the vision of just making everything oh, just that noises. little bit easier, I think really helps people. And then oh. probably the highlight for me was one of my personals got to train for the first time and yeah. just super proud of that. So let's talk about that for a bit. If, tell us about who that, who that individual was. You, you did a great training. I've, the feedback was phenomenal on social media. So who did you train with, and why is that so special for you? Um, so I trained with Jennifer Becker. and Jennifer Becker. It's special for me because she and I kind of went back and forth on this topic of social media, and she really just dug into it, and I loved being able to see her come alive. And she, she just lit up on stage, and seeing her grow as a leader and be able to <gasps> help so many in the audience. We got so I much feedback that. afterwards about how the message was very timely for people. Um, and that was very rewarding. That's great, Heidi. I can tell. I can tell in your eyes on that. So if, if I may, uh, talk just a bit also about your organization. You have a definite... You don't need to keep that mic specifically that close. I mean, so my mic... This mic specifically, you do want to have it closer, but you want to have about a fist away from it. And if you need a cloud lifter with it you, you to get enough power, you'd put a cloud lifter with it. But that is a traditional, that's a traditional mic. It's, it's relative, and you can change the sensitivity. And he himself is keeping about half a fist away from his own mouth, and he's shoving it in their mouths. And a passion for, for helping moms. And uh, if you don't mind, uh, tell, tell everyone is a bit about your background and uh, why is this such an important topic for you and how you, how you refer other customers to Melaleuca? 
Yeah, I have a passion for bringing women out of the corporate world. Um, oh. My background is in the pharmaceutical industry, as you know, <gasps> and I feel like when women have children, Bye, we get kind of stuck in this decision of, do we fully invest as a mom or do we fully invest in our career? Both, you can and do both. And I love Mel Luca because it's given me both. And so I just have a passion of bringing that to other women and letting them have that choice and letting them make the decision that they can really be an excellent mom, but also bring in the type of income that their family likely needs. And um, it's been so am amazing for me to be able to watch women and just how they breathe differently and they interact with their family differently and the stress reduction when they know they can do the things that they want to with their kids, but they can also provide. That's great. To your, this year I will goal, in our opening video and general session, I saw you up on the big screen. You have a specific goal. What is it and why is it so important to you? My this year I will goal is that I will be a corporate director this year. And it's very important to me because I feel like um, in me doing that, I set the pace for my team to say that they can do it as well. And um, yeah, and that's going to help a lot of other people. Okay, well, listen, is Brett watching right now? Uh, because, Brett and then uh, who husband. else besides Brett would like to give a shout out to back, back home? So, my little girls, Katie and Becca, hi. Um, and my husband, Brett. And then we have some really close family friends, uh, the Martins, that are also watching. So, hi, everyone. Okay. Brett, how you doing? Good to see you. All right, Heidi, Hi, we're going to take a quick picture for Instagram, and then we'll uh, go to Mary Jo's next. Here we go. Mary Jo's next. I'm writing down the names so that we can look into these accounts to see if they're still in Melaleuca. Because this is in 2016, so they've either stayed and gotten huge, or they're smaller. Or they're not there anymore. Thank you, Heidi. Mary Jo and Alan Tolliver, come on in. Mary How are jo. you? Yeah. All right, so I'm doing really, really well. Tolliver. You have had quite a year as well. And you are in the running for some pretty big awards here uh, this evening. So what are, you, what are you most looking forward to about the night? I'm really excited that we're going to be celebrating with our team and our organization and that everyone's here and excited about hearing about all the new promotions. Yeah. So there's a lot, there's a lot of big news to share. How about for you, Alan? What are you most looking forward to? Um, like she said, uh, celebrating with our team um, and What's being able saying? to share the evening with them, I think, is our biggest thing. So convention 2016, this year I will. We've talked about a lot of lot of products and core messages. And how about for you? What's been the biggest takeaway that you've heard here at convention, our final night? I think it's the simplification of the enrollment process. I think it's the new product introductions. I think it's the ability to share that this is really a passionate company. They stand behind everything they believe in. And you can feel confident that they we're in this for the long haul. Yeah. How, how about for you, Alan? This was um, our 13th convention, probably the best, and the, the trainings are amazing. The The belief that you get from the company, um, it, I, th I think it's the most amazing part. So you are, within Mel Luca, you're known as uh, the couple that really values the products and are, are believe in the Mel Luca wellness products. We've launched about 15 or 20 products here. What, what are you most excited about as you look to get home and, and share this with other customers? I love the new um, uh, the intestinal supplement. I think it's going to help so many people improve. The new intestinal supplement? Oh, my God. With the quality of their life and feel comfortable. It's yeah, going to be huge. Yeah, it will. It will. How about for you, Alan? Oh, the granola. Easy. Alan. <laughs> Yeah, so the, the granola is a huge market. It's, gonna, it's, it's highly consumable, and so we're looking forward to that one as well. Last question I have for you. Your this year I will goal is what, and why is it important to you? This year I will empower more leaders to be successful. I have four new business partners who are all running for senior director. I believe they each have the potential to be executive directors. He's touching her back again. And I want to empower people to really lead from the front. Mm. Powerful goal. That's, that's deep. That's really good. Yeah. How about you? That exactly the same. Um, when when our team advances and reaches their goals, then everything works out for us. Okay. So I lied. I have one more question. When our team reaches their goal, everything else works out for us. <laughs> How profound that you are at the top of a pyramid, my dude. 
you're in the running, I believe, for one of the top qualifiers for President's Club. Am I right? Super excited. This would be our third time. Uh, exceptional experience. It's incredible to get to spend time with Frank and Belinda, get to know them, get to know the other leaders of the company, and really come together as a team and, and have a great time. Well, President's Club is the pinnacle. You know, if this were the Oscars, this is like the best movie, right? So best you luck to you. I hope back. to see you on stage. Congratulations on a fantastic year. Thank you. See you this year. Oh, you know what? Sorry. Who are we going to give a shout out to uh, back home? Absolutely. Our family, our daughter, Rachel, our son, Zachary, all of our team that couldn't make it. We just are super excited that you're with us um, here online. So Hi, have guys. fun. Anyone else to add? Uh, I think she named everyone. Okay. Let's get a quick Instagram photo. Here we go. Alan, Mary, Joe, thank you very much. Alan Good luck Mary tonight. Joe. Okay, we have Alex, and is this Carla? Come on in. How are you? Pleasure to meet you. Come on, she right, right in here. Good. Let's see, Carla's Good. right here. Alex. That dude. That dude tried to get in between, and 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 the speaker pushed him out. Are we gonna rewind this? Yes, we are. Look at that. Look, look at this. Alex and Carla, look at this. And is this Carla? Come on in, how are you? Pleasure to meet you. Come on she right. Doesn't, she doesn't want to go over there. She doesn't want to go over there. He, the guy tried to get him right in here. Let's see, Carla's right here, Alex. Look at, oh my God. And he has his aunt hand on her lower back. He tried to he tried to step in that way. He tried to step in the way. Right in the stand right there. I'm running a background check on this dude. And we're going to be looking right at that camera there. So, all right, it's a pleasure to meet you. Another first touch. Off. So, so, fiancé, correct, with Mr. Alex? So, so tell, this is your very first convention. Another touch. Second. Another so touch. So, she was here last year as well? Another touch. Okay, so, uh, what, what, what are your observations? What, what, do you, what do you think of this guy to your left? <laughs> oh, it's the best man of my life, and I love him. I love him, and... Well, cool. Alex, uh, corporate director two, advancing to corporate director and corporate director two in 2015, 16, and you're coming in. I mean, what what a week for you and and for your organization. How, how would you describe it? Uh, it's it's just been a great run. Uh, I found some great teammates, people that really want to make a difference. Uh, I I've I've just uh, focused that year in, in helping people that want to change their life and they want to enhance their financial life. So it's it's been a it's been a great run, and I feel like I'm getting started though. So what's what's your this year I will goal? I mean you have you've obviously accomplished a lot. I'm friends with one of Herbalife's president's team members. Her dad is also one. He got diagnosed with cancer last year and she just announced she has cancer at 39. What? Oh, I'm so sorry. That's twisty. for if I if you don't mind me asking how old are you Alex I just turned 28 okay man you are so young let me tell you so what what's next for you I mean you've accomplished so much but what, what what's next for you uh, well I'm getting married in October October 28 so that's that's uh, definitely and uh, right ahead uh, but I also in my business I I want to uh, when I hit corporate three um, and I want to do it within six months six to eight months I think I'm calculating that I could I could pull that off um, and then hopefully by next convention, maybe corporate director four, but I know for sure I could do corporate director three. Okay, so, so what do, if you look at the kind of messages we've had another, here at another convention, a lot of new products, a lot of great trainings, but for those other 20-somethings out there another that, touch. that are just wa watching this evening, what message would you have for them just about, about how, to, how, to, how to set goals and how to, how to, how to dream? What, what would you say to them? Sure, I mean, just, just don't, don't put any limits on yourself. Uh, I started when I was 20, and I, I didn't think that 
um, I just thought that it was possible. I never thought that I could not do it. Yeah, I, I, I'm I, I'm only like looking at and mostly like stuff that from growing up. I'm mostly looking at like when someone leans back and when someone gets pulled in when someone else is trying to insert themselves because they know that they don't want to stand next to someone. I think she's, I think that she's uncomfortable probably because one, um, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, be successful in the business. So um, I just set my goals high. I wanted to have a place for myself. I wanted to have my own car. I wanted to get out of debt that I accumulated when I was going to college. So all that all that became true uh, within just a year or two. I was earning enough money where I could where I could have that. Uh, so now my goals are bigger. Of course, now that I'm corporate director, uh, the average income for a corporate director is is uh, is a lot. So so aim high, aim high. You could do it. Just stay focused. Uh, they 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 spoke about 20 calls a week. Uh, which I think is very doable. Uh, just stay focused on the basics. That's right. And 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 the the. In Why did they zoom in? Because were they trying to cut out what this guy's doing with his left hand? Come that it, that comes from from the corporate directors, right? So that it changes. It Get your hand away from her boobs. It really does change change lives. So so with that, we are going to be going to uh, to Nate next. Nate. What about the Instagram picture? Back to you. Thank you, Alex and Carla. Another touch. Appreciate it. Okay. All right. This simple 30-second web reverses memory loss for good. I didn't want people around me anymore who didn't good. like me it's for so me. Easy. And you can do it from the I was finally showing home. up as me, and, and I knew it was ever... Sorry. From Asaki. Oh, my God. Okay, we're going to go back. So, so now we're going to look at the names. Oh, my God. There's a Melaleuca convention channel. This is the this is the creator of, of of. All right, thank you very much, Darren, for that tour. We are so pleased to be joined now with the CEO of Melaleuca, Frank Vandersloot. Frank, it has been an incredible uh, convention this year. Well, you know, every year has been really great, and every year is an event, a life changing event, for different people. But uh, I think uh, this is a forum where people can think deeply about where they are in life, be th thinking deeply about what life is about. And, and learn how to take charge of their own lives and, and hopefully make some decisions that they are going to do exactly that. And a lot of people go forward from this point, from the convention, and change their life. So that's, uh, we hope that we have created an environment where that could happen. Well, there's a lot of people watching right now that may have thought, well, maybe I'll go, but maybe not. Or maybe they're looking forward to next year. They just haven't made that decision. Why do they need to come? Well, um, so I've got two cameras here. Which camera can I look at? Look Where at this are, one, right? This? Here. So this is the founder of Melaleuca. His name is his last name is Vandersloot. This there is where go. they are. They're, yes. they're in that, they're in <laughs> they're that in box that little right camera. there. <laughs> well, to everybody who's who's tuned yeah. into us first. Yeah, and, and exactly, and we know. Yeah, we know it's not an exact exact science or anything like. That. Um, thank you for for joining us tonight, and um, I would just tell you we missed you here. We missed you, and hopefully, hopefully you can come next year. But I hope, hopefully, your leaders will tell you what happened here, what happened to them, what they learned here. Uh, we give good teaching, uh, good teachings where people can learn how to how to take charge of their lives. Which is specifically, if 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 you know Melaleuca and you know who we are, then all you have to do is reach out and tell people about it, and and that's how we got to where we are today. You know, 155,000 wow. new households joined us just last month. That's been happening every month. Well, 155 was a little larger than the previous record, the previous month, 153,000, but that's how it's been, 150,000 households every single month. We're, we're growing like a rocket ship. Yeah. It's unbelievable. We've grown before, but never like this. So this is a great time. It's a great time to be involved with Melaleuca, and uh, we are having a good time here, and, and I think a lot of lives have changed. We won't know that, of course, until we go forward and we watch what happen, what happens in individual lives over the next couple of months. But um, it's 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 for sure going to happen. We're we're going to celebrate tonight. We're going to have some fun and pay tribute to some of these great leaders who've shown others that it can be done. It's 
That's an important thing to do. I look out behind you and there's thousands of people here from all over the world that have started their own businesses, that have had success beyond their wildest dreams. Looking back 31 years ago, did you ever foresee all of this? No, no. I thought, you know, when we started, I thought it was going to be good. Mm -hmm. But I had no idea that it was going to be this good. And now we know. Now we know. It's, you know, we hit... Uh, a billion dollars just a few years ago, and, and this year we're going to be at about 1.8. It looks like so we'll, we grew by we grew by $500,000 wow. in the last 12 uh, 500 million dollars in the last 12 months. So it took us uh, let's see, it took us seven eight. It took us 18 years to the, to get to the first half a million. Then it took us nine years to get the to the to the next half a billion dollars, uh, the next 500 million. Then it took us four years to get to the next 500 million. And now it's taken us 12 months. I mean, it's a rocket ship. <laughs> so you just look at that trajectory and it just, it's just launching. It's our time. Yeah. And um, so it's a fun time for me. So, so for those people watching, who knows where you'll be next year at this time, next year at convention? Well, uh, yeah, I guess the question is, where are you going to be, you as individuals? <laughs> Where are you going to be next year? And that's totally up to you. Uh, hopefully you'll be at this convention next year here in Salt Lake City. We'd like, like to have you here. But don't wait till then. Get going now. Learn from what your, your leaders come home and tell you about. And, uh, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make a little pitch for a book. It's a book that has a, a full chapter dedicated to it about Melaleuca. It's a, a piece about our history about four years ago. Um, it's The Intimidation Factor by Kim Strassel. Uh, it's not out yet. It'll be out uh, on the 21st of June. Uh, and it's a very uh, it's an important book to our history. And it says a lot of great things about Melaleuca. And it says uh, uh, a few great things that people should know about our history. So um, I'm looking to that book, too. The Intimidation Factor by Kim Strassel. Uh, that you can buy it online now. You can pre-buy it, and, the, and they won't hit your credit card until the book comes out, which will be June 21st. Uh, okay. I recommend it. Uh, people, if you're going to be out representing Maluka, then you need to know a piece of that history because you might be asked about a few of those things. Yeah. The theme is This Year I Will. What's Frank Vandersloot's This Year Frank I Will? Frank Vandersloot. Well, we're going to keep doing what we've been doing, and we keep bringing the message to people of hope, uh, of of the idea that they can take charge of their own lives. And we're going to be continue to show evidence. You know, faith, we need faith. Faith in ourselves, faith in each other, faith no. in what we're doing. And uh, we believe that we're faith builders, but how you build faith is you just show people the evidence. Oops, sorry. And, uh, th and we've got a lot of great people here tonight. We're going to have a great celebration, celebrating some great leaders, people that have overcome hardship, people who have fell in fallen down a thousand times and gotten up a thousand Whoops. times. I messed up, and, sorry. And that's what success is all about. So um, we're going to celebrate that now, and then we're going to, tomorrow we're going to get back to work. I don't know if Sky's still here, hello. Uh, for next year. You know, if people have enough resources, they can have a great life. Not having enough resources makes for a tough life. I've been there. My family that I grew up with, uh, grew up in, my dad always struggled to make ends meet. And uh, it doesn't have to be that way. People want to take charge. So that's what we're going to be teaching. Frank, thank you very much. Is there anything else that you want to add? Any no, final message? Um, just uh, we appreciate and love everyone that uh, has joined us with this company. We appreciate all of the hard work. I hope y'all are safe, Sky. You know, we're, uh, we're going to be at, uh, we're going to finish this year at $1.8 billion. That's mm. what it looks like from where we are right now. We just passed the $1.4 billion mark. Excellent. And um, so that's, um, that's tr if you watch where we were last year at 1.3, that's, that's tremendous growth. The question is what part of this business is going to be yours? And those who have built that, those who have brought us to this point, thank you. Thank you for believing in us. Thank you for all your hard work and thank you for your leadership. Frank Vandersloot, the CEO of Melaleuca, always. Okay. All right, so now we're going to go to um, Instagram. Uh, escape. All right, we're going to go. We can't use an incognito window, so we are going to go to a regular Chrome window. 
Okay. No, we're not. <clears throat> we're going to have to use freaking Safari. We just won't do any sound. Okay. All right, here's the first name. We are going to do Heidi Bartoletta. No, we're not. We're going to do Laura Garza. Or not. Laura Garza Melaleuca. Um, uh, my Spanish is not good. Did she change working for Melaleuca? Melaleuca success stories. I I'm looking for, maybe that's too common of a name. Okay. All right, we'll go to the next one. Raphael and Monica Roja Rojas, corporate director. Uh, unmute. This video has no sound. <laughs> Did we not check this? Journey, journey to financial freedom? Oh my God. Corporate Director 6. McKay's message. When was this posted? Year started 2005. Personally enrolled customers 182. 2012, this is so old, 2012 monthly check, $107,011. How is this? What did we stumble onto? I would say we would report this, but... Oh, it's actually from Melaleuca. Mm. Why are they allowed to say lifetime earning six million dollars? Raphael and Monica Rojas. Sorry, I spelled it wrong. Corporate Director 5, are they still in Melaleuca? This is too old. Are they not in anymore? Instagram. Monica Rojas. Monica Rojas Fitness. Monica Rojas. Hmm. 2008, 2014. GC Control. Mm, let's just go back to YouTube real quick. Sorry. Maybe they're not in anymore. This is eight years ago. Oh my gosh, Rafael Rojas official. What number? YouTube. Okay. Safari's being an asshole. Quit. Here we go. Hola, mi nombre Rafael Rojas y le damos la bienvenida. Sorry, I need to turn on closed captioning with English. Because I am not a fluent auto translate to English. Hello, my name is Rafael Rojas, and we welcome you. Bienvenida a nuestro programa del día de hoy. El día de hoy voy a estar hablando de cómo mantener 
la visión viva. So are they not in? He has 53,000 followers. Does he not have? Muchas personas me preguntan. I don't know what I'm. I know. I know. I don't know what the hell I'm doing with my life. Sorry. I lost internet and then there was lag and so here, here I am. This is Heidi Bartolotta. I don't know if she is still in Melaleuca. Mom's making six figures 2009 to present. Are you not listing Melaleuca? When was this written? Corporate Director 2. So, Melaleuca Top Ranks. Leader Board. 2023. This month's Leadership in Action magazine, blah, blah, blah. I want to see the Leader Board. Okay. A marketing revolution, the Melaleuca Compensation Plan, helping you create the financial resources you need for an extraordinary life. Oh my God, there's so many words and so few pictures. You earn commissions from customers who were enrolled by you and enrolled by others. And you're telling me it's not a multi-level marketing scheme. I mean, business. So there's director. Director two, director three, all the way up to senior director. Then there's senior director levels, then there's executive director, and then there is national corporate and presidential director. Here we go. Here are the ranks. Presidential director. So a presidential director, they're doing a million dollars in monthly organizational volume, but I'm not sure how much they're actually making. And they get a $1 million advancement bonus. Holy moly. Korea, howdy. So this is the fine print. I just want to know the search terms that we are looking for, which is if we get to presidential director, we can go back that way. So we'll keep this and we will go to presidential Cole Klinger is the new president. Jeff and Maureen Miller achieve presidential director. Okay, good news. Oh, business for home. I hate you. Jeff and Maureen Miller. When was this done? When was this written? 2019? That's four years ago. Karina, Doug, how are you? Sorry. Good to see you. Welcome. And Doug? Welcome to the stage. Thank you. So you are also first time convention attendees and uh, how has the first, uh, first convention been for you? It's incredible. I already feel like we've learned so much to take back to the team. We've given you a lot to digest, haven't we? Sorry. Let's, let, let's go back now one year ago because you, you uh, it, did not, it did not just happen automatically as far as your, your advancement to executive director four. And so let's, let's start way back. You enrolled in January 2016, but really the story started in January of 2015 when your, your family experienced a few changes. Let's take us back to January 2015. What happened? I was um, laid off, lost my job. Um, it was just really devastating time. Um, just totally detrimental to our family. 
Um, we tried to hide it from the kids, but you can only hide it for so long. Oh, it was upset. tough. Um, I, fell, I fell into depression. Um, lost a lot of self-worth. I remember having to go outside. It, the kids would come and ask for something as small as tennis shoes. And I'd have to walk outside to cry. So Sabrina, that time period when Doug was out of work there, just, just how, how, how bad did it get for your family? How, how, what was the situation like? It was really hard. Um, I'd always been home with the kids, and so I went back to work doing accounting. So I was working about 35 hours a week. We sold a vehicle. Um, we um, were putting kids' clothes on Facebook groups and things like that. Just to, we really wanted to keep our home and didn't want to sell our home. So, so now let's now it's January 2016. Someone introduced you to Melaleuca, and was the intent from the beginning to build a business? Sherry Bettinger invited me to Starbucks Sherry to tell me Bettinger. about Melaleuca, and I actually left the house um, not knowing what Melaleuca was, but um, thinking, I'll hear what she has to say, but we can't do anything right now. We can't even add $5 to our budget, and so... The, no, but in no way did I think I would build a business. All right, so why did you enroll in the first place? Um, well, she just showed me that it was a great store and that um, it wouldn't add anything to my budget. I actually could save money, and so, so we started shopping. Well, look, so you referred a few customers along the way. What was, what was the first check you, re you remember from Melaleuca? How, how big was that check? $115. $115. So, Doug, what did that mean to your family? Groceries. <laughs> yeah. It made a difference. At the time, it made a difference. And um, I had started a new job May 1st of last year. Um, her first in-home was May 31st. We had four people enrolled that night. And Susie and Steve Meyer were there, Sherry Budinger. It was, um, had no idea what we were starting. Mm. So now let's, let's talk one year ago. Uh, we were all here at convention. You were not at convention. But, and you had your first in-home when? May the 31st. So I was still a shopper only when, when convention was going on last year. Okay. And since that time now, you've advanced very, very quickly. If, if I, from, from memory here, you've advanced Paysetter, obviously direct, Paysetter Senior Director ranks, and your, your check when you advanced is Senior Director 8. What was, what was that check and, 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 just, and what did that mean for you? Oh goodness, I'm trying to remember when that was. I think that was probably in September. I think it was $9,900. That... Something like that. Yep. And so what, what, did that, what did that mean to your family when you started earning that type of income month after month? It was awesome. I went ahead and quit the accounting job and I thought, you know what, I'm gonna just put more, more time into this. Cause I'd been maybe doing about 15 hours a week. And so we just bumped it up and, and did it full time. Okay, so now executive director four. I think everyone's wondering, you know, a year ago, Boy, just you're, you're a marketing executive, not intent on building a business, and here you stand at convention 2017, your very, very first convention as an executive director for. How did you do it? In fact, share with everyone here how, how you did it. I would just say we worked really hard. We put um, a lot, a lot of time into it, lots of hours. We did lots of in-homes, and um, I spend a lot of time on the My Melaleuca training. I love that tool. I love that there are so many experts on there. I don't have to try to in, reinvent the wheel. I just, um, I get a nugget, I get more than a nugget every time I listen to those. And I really listen to them daily. Um, my kids actually, when we're in the car, they're like, oh no, she's putting, playing that through the, the speaker again. But um, that's, that's been huge to me. All right, so, uh, so uh, within the mind, I look at a lot of different trainings. Uh, who's, who are a couple of your go-tos? If you're, you're taking a car ride with the kids, who are they listening to to paint the picture for us? Oh, my goodness, there's lots. I would say um, John Duffner has been huge because I like the way he's real direct. And it just, John um, Duffner. I, uh, it's, um, <laughs> my personality is probably greatly different than his, but um, I, he's so to the point that I get it. I, get, I know what I need to do. Yeah. Um, of course, Ed Vistoso and... Um, and Raphael, of course, and just so, so many. Well, look, um, Executive Director 4, right? You've come a long way. A $115 check. What was, what was your check when you advanced to Executive Director 4? Mm, it 
the six seventy one seventy one thousand thousand dollars a month. Yeah. Dollars. Mm -hmm. So, <laughs> Doug, Doug, I can't help but notice, but you remember that number more than Sabrina did. <laughs> So tell us a little bit about what that check meant for you. Boy, you've come a long way here, Doug. Oh, it's, um, can't hardly put words to it, but it, um, I'll look it it's up, taking Blaine. a lot of burden off. Um, we had been sinking. Uh, when I got a new job, we started to tread water. Now we're swimming. <laughs> Fantastic. And uh, that's how it feels, literally. So t tell us a little more about, about your children. How many children do you have and what are their ages? We have five kids, and all right, let me get this right, 13, <laughs> 17, 18, 21, 24, about to be 25. Yes. That was so good. I did it. I'm telling you, I was so pulling for you right there. <laughs> So uh, I know we had, a, we had a conversation backstage, and you talked about a, a special dinner you had before you came to convention with, with the family. Right. What, what, what was that dinner like, and what, what did you tell them? Oh, it was just, um, we just kind of laid the law down about what we expected while we were gone first. But um, when mom and dad are gone, listen, here's how it goes. But um, more importantly, we just sat and shared. We, we just kind of reflected on the past year, um, how far we had come how a year ago, we couldn't have done what we did that night. We couldn't go to dinner. And we didn't go somewhere extravagant. We went to Cracker Barrel. <laughs> but we couldn't have done that a year ago. And it was, um, it was pretty interesting. I mean, we were all in the car together, and it was just a lot of smiles, a lot of laughs. And um, that's been restored to the house, because there, before, there weren't a lot of smiles and laughter. Great. Well, Sabrina, let's talk about it the kids as far be... as their involvement in this business as well. How have they been part of this? Uh, this... Um, it might be Steve Taylor or Brian Austin. I'm going to look for a picture right now. Let's go. New. Now. Steve Taylor Melaleka. Bing. I don't know how to get this off of Chrome. That's not him. Picture? Of course not. How professional. <sighs> CEO, honorees, back row. None of them. Okay, why is this pulling up? I was looking at Melaleuca. I feel like I'm having about to implode. Hey, Clown Town. Squeak off, hello. Uh, so it may not be Steve Taylor. What about Brian? My internet went out earlier, Clown Town, and um, this is a second stream. That's not him. Okay, who's the next guy? Did he get fired? Sorry, I know I have my fan on because I'm really overheated. I'm trying to like refocus on this. Um, Maybe it will tell us. Who's the guy that continues to interview people? Jordan. All right, we'll finish this and all. Decision and supporting you as you and Doug have moved forward. 
Well, it's been huge. I would say, first off, um, you know, there's been some sacrifices. So the kids are in a lot of sports. They do a lot of basketball. And so I've missed some games and things like that. And so they've been really understanding. They just know that it's for a season, but this is, we're going to really pour into the business for right now. But then also they help me. So um, we do lots of follow-up with, with our personal customers. So we do thank you notes and little renew lotions and chapsticks and things. And so they'll, I send them to the store. They get all the packing material, the thank you notes, and then they write a lot of them and address them. That's good. So that kind of thing, and then take them in to the post office. I don't know who it is. Wonderful. A lot of hard work. Um, social media versus live belly to belly. Which, which way are you build your business? Oh, in homes. In homes. Definitely lots of in homes. Some so, one on ones, and you know, a few webcasts too, but in homes. So in just a few minutes, we're going to be having new and advancing senior directors walk this stage. Mm -hmm. Someone very special is waiting in the wings. Who's, who's waiting to come out? In fact, that was your biggest concern. Can I get back off the stage in order to see her walk the stage? Who, who's waiting? Sheila Smith. She's senior director too, and we think she probably went senior four. Really? Mm -hmm. So uh, so when she advances senior director, her check was, do you remember? Around 31000 yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. And wow. what does that mean to her? What does that mean to her and her family? We're going to oh, report this too. for her. Yeah, it's absolutely huge for their family. So I'm just so excited for her. Well, listen, we're going we're gonna to let you get off the stage and get ready to greet her and to celebrate with her. We are so, so proud of you and what you've accomplished. I do have to know, one year ago, you were marketing executive, now executive director four. When you come back here to convention, what's the goal? By the end of this year, the goal is national. So we're just going to do the best we can. But okay. that's burning a mortgage. Yeah. Burning a mortgage. Yeah. All right. I love it. Oh, we're going to write it down. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, executive director four, Sabrina and Doug Ellis. <laughs> Sabrina and Doug Ellis. Okay. Sorry, I'm making a list of all these people, but I want to find out who this guy is. News and meetings. Where's the team? Oh. Advancements. We found it! Okay, I think we found it. Oh, I need a password. If you're in Melaleuca and you have a password and you wouldn't mind me taking a peek around, let me send me a DM on Instagram. Oh, man. We found it, but it's password freaking protected. Who is this dude? Who are, is the executive team at Melaleuca? Google. Oops, Melaleuca. Craft.melaleuca.com. Comparably, that's not the right one. Melaleuca News. Frank Vandersloot. Okay. Um, I think it's this dude on the left, but he looks different. Um, wait, is it Frank Vandersloot? Is that him? Hold on. I know we're going to find it. We're going to find it on their Instagram page. We are just going to do it. Okay. Melaleuca. And they're following seven people. And who are those seven people? Is it Darren Johnson? Yep, Darren Johnson. We got him. Okay. It's this guy, right? That's him. Isn't it? That's got to be him. It's 2023. Okay, I know. <laughs> Thank you, Shadow. I'm sorry. I know y'all are yelling at me. I get like, I have a hard time multitasking. <laughs> I know. I'm sorry. Credit goes to Shadow. <laughs> I have a hard time like looking at multiple things at the same time. 
I don't know why any of y'all follow me, but I really appreciate it. <laughs> uh, thank you, Shadow. You're incredible. Hearts and hype in the chat for Shadow because what am I even doing? <laughs> Oh my god, I'm sorry. I'm so dense sometimes. Okay. All right, okay. Darren Johnson, Idaho Falls, Idaho dad, husband, leader, and communicator, host of I Dare You Pod. He's got a podcast? Is he not with Melaleuca anymore? Darren Johnson. Senior VP of Sales at Melaleuca. Twenty twelve to present. Oh no. Oh no. I had a melt I had a meltdown yesterday in front of my parents and I'm trying not to have a meltdown right now. Me to Johnson Nutrition 10 years and 5 months. North Dakota Interesting. Shadow is the MVP of sleuthing. Thank you, Shadow. I was with them for three years. Shadow, so I've got questions. Is there a way to see the rank ups? I love you in a non culty way. Is there a way to log in with the rank ups, like with a ghost account? So I have their compensation plan here. And I have this, so the reports and tools, um, but I need a login. I want to see advancements, but I can't. Carolyn, howdy! Oh. I assumed he was a hired MC. You know what? I did too. Jessica Rabble Red Carpet. Okay, I'm adding her to the name. What can I expect at convention? How Mel Luca's newest national director went from dreading Mondays to loving life. Let's do it. So 18 years ago, I made a decision to leave corporate America because I had a brand new baby girl. It was non-negotiable for me. I needed to be a work at home mom. So I did, I always joke and say, I did what any sane person would do. And I, I opened an in-home all moms work and all parents work and all people work if they are taking care of kids at home, okay? Sorry, I need to take some of my medicine. Oh. Sorry. I was trying to stand away from the mic. Okay. Play. I hate the parents shaming like they can go to work. Yes. Daycare and welcome 12 kids into my home every single day. <laughs> and you know what though? I have, th I have three beautiful children and while they were little, it was perfect. But one day I woke up and my youngest was now off to school full time. And I started to recognize that the daycare had served its purpose. I felt burnout. It's exhausting. I love kids, but it's hard work. I worked 60 hours a week. I had no time off. When my kids were in school, I couldn't leave. I remember one day my son, oh my God, I'm crying already. This is not gonna be good. 
My, my son said, Mom, you are the only one not there for the Halloween march. I said, I got to fix this. My family sacrificed. My husband, he would call me every day and say, are all the daycare families gone yet? And I might say, well, there's still two, two kids here. And he'd say, OK, I'll keep driving around the block. <laughs> what an asshole. And it was just chaos in our house at, at pickup time. Um, I will say this. What, what an asshole move. I'm sorry. I have no grace for that. Oh, I'll just keep driving around and let my partner just suffer at home by themselves. And, you know, are, are you serious? I began to hate Sundays. You know, you hear people say all the time, oh, it's Monday. Sundays, I would cry myself to sleep because it just was time. Um, I think a lot of moms sometimes feel guilt if they feel this need to um, give their gift to the world. You know, we start feeling, we tell ourselves this, isn't it enough that I'm, I'm their mom? And isn't it enough that I'm John's wife? And those things are my life, but they're still me. I, I lost that, I think, somewhere along the way. Um, financially, um, things were not easy. Um, I, I was that one that took the calculator to the grocery store with me every week. My husband would call me and say, can I get gas in the car? And we never felt like in our mind, rich people filled their tank. Like we, we never filled the tank ever. Half a tank was filled, was a full tank for us. Um, my dad always helped us to buy Christmas gifts for our kids. He always helped me get school clothes for the kids. It felt like a big mom fail that I couldn't provide the way that I wanted. And then by the grace of God, in September of 2010, John Cosentino dared my daycare because I said, listen, if this guy wants to talk to me, he's got to come when I'm working because I can't leave work. So he did. 12 kids. If you know John, he'll tell you himself, I'm like ADD. So he was so, oh. so but he did an overview for me. And um, uh, he, he drove. You're telling me that if you're going to do a sales pitch, that you're going to say, I'm going to do it in the uh, when she she's supposed to be looking after kids. And that's when you decide to go in so that they can't really focus on your pitch. That is an a-hole move, too. 15 hours round trip to do my first in-home where I had 18 people in the living room. And I jumped up when he finished that first overview, and I dismissed the whole room and said, nobody needs to do anything today. You can all go home. We'll talk about it later. And John just looked at me. And would, if you were John, you would have given up on me. I'm sure of it. But he never did. John and Sherry have become family. Oh my god. And I love them so much. We worked. And ultimately, my check started to make my car payment. That was huge. Um, then it made my mortgage payment. 18 months after be, being a Melaleuca shopper, I closed my daycare. Thanks to Frank's vision, so much has happened. We bought our dream home, which uh, sounds lavish, but it, it's a tiny little log home in the middle of the woods it was surrounded by 43 acres of trees. It might, it might feel like punishment to some people, but it's, it's heaven for us. We have, um, we have paid off almost all of our debt. Really, just our home is left. Um, we have a savings account for the first time ever in our lives. So my daughter is 18. She's getting ready to go to college, and I am not ready for her to go. But I don't have to worry about how I'm going to pay for it. We can do that in cash. Um. <laughs> it's the... I know, my stream's been all over the place. I like watching these videos because these are the stories, and this is what people are hearing that's getting them to get excited and to either stay in Melaleuca or join Melaleuca. 
and that she's a very pretty crier. I'll say that. I look like I I look like I've been run over when I start crying. So. So my parents have been divorced since I've been old enough to remember otherwise. And um, my dad was always the one that helped us financially. My mom. She's has actually crying. One of my only wishes for my mom was for her to just not have it so hard. So in January, my husband and I and my kids welcomed her into our home and she lives with us now. Um, and as some of you may know, um, I was diagnosed with breast cancer when I was. My sister Molly was there for me to help me feel like I could get through a day. And uh, apparently she wanted me to repay the favor because she was diagnosed not long after, oh. a few years later. So we went through this, this thing together. And now, now we have this thing together. We, we build from our hearts every single day. Molly, I love you so much. You have no idea. I think you do, but I'm so blessed to work with my sister and have this between us and our team. Our team is not a team. We are a family. Oh my God. We all love each other unconditionally. We help each other. We lift each other up. We, um, if Mel and Luca closed their doors tomorrow, I would have an army of friendships to last a lifetime. It's pure love. And, and I, have, I have found me again. So to say thank you to Frank would not be adequate. We can only hope, I can only hope that he can feel my heart. Thank you. What? I know, this is all over the place. Um, marketing executives of the year. This is a rank, I think. Ladies and gentlemen, Melaleuca's 2017 Marketing Executives of the Year from Humboldt, Iowa, Executive Director 9, Krista and Jordan Weiniger. Okay. They know beforehand. I don't know why they're crying. Okay, music that's gonna get us slapped. Oh, Scout, I'm sorry. Yes, definitely, like, get to sleep when you can. Oh, music. Oh, my God. You told me uh, yesterday, I believe you were a little, little stressed, frustrated and before Melaleuca. Tell us about that. Yeah, I, um, I have a social work background, so I always worked really hard. I never really made a lot of money. At the time, I was actually um, part-time lifeguarding at our rec center for eight bucks an hour. Um, Jordan hated it, thought it was just such a waste of time to be gone from our family, but it brought in 200 bucks a month. It helped, so I did that. And your most that you ever made in a month doing that uh, social work and lifeguarding was how much? About, well, if the social work was about fourteen ninety a month I brought home with my last job. I was director of a program, and uh, lifeguarding was one ninety nine was my best month. So maybe 25000 a year. <laughs> no, $23,660. <laughs> and what was your check last month? $31,100. <laughs> So, life today? Not the same. It's different. I just, we last year paid off all our debt minus our house, which was always a big goal, but we never had any money. Um, time freedom. We're so happy. We were always so stressed, and it was hard on our marriage. You know, I mean, the first person that you take it out on is the person you care about the most, and we don't have that. We're literally blissfully happy. 
Uh, wow. We're sure proud of you. This is a wonderful accomplishment. Mark wow. accomplishment. Marketing Executives of the Year, 2017. We couldn't be more proud. Congratulations to both of you. Yeah. Right. And I'm here with Chris and Jordan Weininger, uh, Executive Directors 9, Marketing Executives of the Year. Let me say that again. <laughs> Marketing Executives of the Year, Chris and Jordan Weininger. Oh. How's, how's it sound? I, I still, I still don't believe it. It's still, I don't know. I'm still in shock. I think. Yeah. How about for you, Jordan? It's been amazing. Uh, I know she hasn't slept the last couple of days just from excitement. So, um, just absolutely thrilled. So. And yet, I suspect maybe even a, a more special moment happened about four minutes later when we announced Team of the Year, which was your team, your organization. What did that mean to you to see wow. all those marketing executives uh, coming up to stage? means everything. Yeah. I mean, there's, we did work really hard this year, but we had to find the right people to work with. And it's those people who took the time out of their lives to come to convention with us right. here. So to see them up there and crying and so excited and emotional, that's, yeah. that was everything. Wow. You know, when they came up on stage, I've seen a few teams come up on stage and I'm telling you the the enthusiasm and the excitement for you, I mean, they were, they were, they were so excited for you. That's, that just has to feel incredible. We're here to change lives, right? And so, talk to us a little bit about how, that, how that feels to you, to, to know that you're having an active role in changing lives. I take it really personally. I mean, I'm a social worker by trade, mm. so that's always been a goal of mine, is to help people change their lives, just live better, be happy. And um, I think even besides the part where people came up on the stage, it was almost feedback afterwards, mm. like our team meeting, just hearing, we had everybody come up one by one by one and tell a little bit about their story. And even people who aren't on our team, people right. who are just people we've gotten close to because of Maluka and what they say to us yeah. about, you've inspired us, you've made this attainable. It's good. We're like, oh my gosh, it's <laughs> unreal. That's great. Well, listen, we're really happy for you. This also means that you're earning, you earn President's Club. So you're going oh. to Ireland in about six weeks. Ever been to Ireland? No, <laughs> no. <laughs> We're so excited. That was literally our goal, just coming in the week. Let's yep. hopefully Ireland. Is that right? Um, and then marketing executive year. I mean, it just well, took it over the top. So. Well, they even have Ireland cufflinks. So <laughs> I bought them go. before we knew. Hold on, let our, me see that. Yeah. You're not it's kidding. It's a real yeah. minted <laughs> Ireland coin. I said Fantastic. maybe it'll be our our good luck charm. Well, listen, yeah. what uh, what uh, last question for you? What's what's the goal for next year, 2018? You're executive director nine now, and would you care to care to say what your goal is? Yeah. Here we go. Um, her goals are always higher than <laughs> I think are attainable, but uh, definitely I think national three, national four, five, and that good. range is what we're looking for. Yeah. That's good. That's bringing right. Bringing back more people. We brought yeah. about 50 with us this year, so we'd love to bring back over 100 with good. us next year. That's fantastic. We just, th this is so important, the feedback mm. we've gotten from our team, mm. the trainers, just hearing Frank, hearing you, hearing McKay's yeah. trainings are always. That's not spot on, aren't they? They're always spot on. Check last month was, or was, what was your executive director nine advancement check? $31,100. That's great. Well, listen, we, we are so proud of you. Congratulations on marketing executive of the year. We'll see you in Ireland. Yes. And, uh, and those cufflinks are going as well. Oh, that's <laughs> right. So congratulations, guys. Thank you so much. All right, you bet. Let's, uh, let's shift gears and talk about President's Club. What do you say? Our 2017 Marketing Executives of the Year, Executive Directors 9, Krista and Jordan Weiniger. performers of all year and we're so proud of all of you we've had a great time everybody travel home safely hello i was just watching the britney dawn vod i'm surprised to see you live again yeah i i unfortunately well not unfortunately i just go live i probably don't have the best youtube strategy mostly i like live streaming because i like talking to the live chat and that's why i'm i'm here occasionally a lot <laughs> 
I'm not gonna be embarrassed. I just I just like live streaming. Um, yeah. I'm just saying my employer arranged a company trip to Dublin. I didn't have to pay anything. My hubby was also invited, food, lodging, and travel included. Lynn, we don't need that kind of negative thinking here. <laughs> I still need to watch the Brittany Dawn stream. She, it's not, it, the pot, listen, Katya, you're going to, you're going to lose your shit. It, the, the amount of religious twistiness that she does on her podcast, it's freaking wild. Oh, you like having you too. I'm glad. Um, let's see. So we've got some names I can look up next time. I've already been live for a little bit. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take this stream down. I'm going to take the one from earlier down. I'm going to put them together and I will re-upload it so it can be one continuous stream without some of my technical difficulties in the middle. I am loving your YouTube strategy. I don't sleep well, so this is great. I I love that. I'm glad that I can lull some of y'all to sleep or keep you company while you have insomnia. I The MLM couples are the creepiest. I think so. I think that is it is twisty. So it, it's it's just it's twisty and the the thing is Oh. Thank you, Lynn. I'll try to find the leader stuff. Shadow, you're incredible. Thank you. See, they, there's a little... Reports and tools are here. Reference library, statement of policies. Is this going to let us go in here? I have to... See, I need a login. <laughs> I'm going to save this because I need, this is, this is the site we were looking for earlier. I'm going to put it in my research folder, even though it should say reading, not research, but new enrollments, follow-up center, news and meetings, convention advance, standing ELC. See, they have everything behind a login. Listen, here's the bat signal. <laughs> I need someone's login. I know that other bigger creators have have all the access and stuff. I just want to see the leaderboard so we can start doing a little bit of a deeper snoop. Napped while the internet was out. Love that scout. Val, have a good night's sleep. Um, I got to get caught up and off to VIA so we can do the kids stream. All right. I'm going to go ahead and end the stream. And I will probably be adding Meluka to the lineup if I can get into this, if I can log in. So thank you all for hanging out, and I will catch you on the next live stream. Goodbye.